Greetings fellow humans, my name is Flailbon. welcome to episode 22 of Let's Play Graveyard Keeper. Today is a great day, look at all the steel we have. Yoink. Today we're going to visit Gresvold. Today we are going to maybe look into making an alchemy bench finally. Today we are going to... Maybe do some fishing. I looked up how to do fishing because I didn't, <laughs> couldn't get a handle on. And all you have to do is click when the fishing rod does its little wiggle thing. And I'm not sure if pressing E cancels the fishing process, but that's what I was pressing. And so maybe that was the problem. One firewood. So we'll see. We'll um we'll go and cast a line if we have some time. Just gonna dump some fuel in here for the future. How many mushrooms can we hold? Possibly only twenty. But let's learn that. Let's figure it out. Okay, uh, it's high noon, so we're gonna head into town. Make sure our inventory isn't full of useless things like these sticks we're holding, and these maggots we're holding, and the steel we're holding. Throw that in there. Maggots. I bet we could use maggots for fishing. I bet. Dead house, horse, dead horse, dead house. <laughs> okay. So, Kresvold, you need to sell me a cauldron. Go on, buddy. I know you think cauldrons are super cool. I think I need to buy like one more thing. Uh, give me some simple iron parts. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, maybe I'll unlock tomorrow anyway. Looks pretty full. And the last time we had to wait until the next day, so we'll we'll do that. That's all we need to do here, as far as I remember. Cauldron, Creswold, Fishing, Craft Stories, Wine, Alchemy, question mark. Or Dungeon. I haven't done any Dungeon. So let's catch our fish, and then we'll do Dungeon. That's the plan. And of course, by the time we're done catching our fish, I bet we'll have a corpse, and we'll have to bury that, and we'll consider making a new headstone, and... Waka waka waka. Need a fishing rod. I see. Well, what happened to my fishing rod? Did I just <laughs> abandon it somewhere? Oops. Well. Let's go see if it's in our box somewhere. Maybe I stuck it somewhere and said something like, I will just put it here until I figure out how to do fishing. And then didn't realize that, that would be immediately. Oh, it's the guy. Hey, guy. Oh, no. Um, oh, no, don't leave, buddy. You stay right there. Hold still. I can't believe I forgot. Hopefully he'll stick around for just a little bit longer. Come on. Walk faster. Indeed, that is exactly what I did with the fishing rod. Clever. Although we didn't get a body. 
At least I didn't hear it go clean up clean up. Maybe there's already a body waiting. Well, we'll find out. Okay, merchant. Please be here. <laughs> uh. This guy only sells bulls and then maybe urns eventually. Yeah, let's just go back home. <laughs> Glass goes back in the box. For another week. Parts, parts. So these do only stack to 20. That was my, my question. So we'll just stick the extras in there, and that's that. What do baked apples have? Okay, just plus six experience. So maybe not that worthwhile. Uh, plus six energy. But they also take less fire. Cauldron. Take some carrots down to ye old carrot place. Forty seems good. Craft some more peat. Oh, we do have carrots. Hmm. All right, we have some energy. So it looks like the only thing I can build here now are candelabra or maybe a church shrine. I'm not sure where this goes. We might already have one. That's more of an altar. So I think we'll I'm loath to invest a bunch of money or time into making wooden beams when this can't even be placed or something. The confessional seems interesting, but takes a lot of parts. And the only other thing we could place is candelabras, which I don't think we could place nine candelabras. Candelabre? So we're going to learn to craft stories. Excuse me, book writing tech, inventing stories. Boom. And you know what? Oh, hello. Writing desk. Okay. Takes a little while still. So story takes pen and ink naturally. Clean paper. Ah, and faith. Interesting. And the quality is directly affected by the, these two perks and nothing else, it seems. Okay. Not bad. So that means if we get these perks, then we can produce gold stories. Maybe. Maybe not. Which can then be turned into notes. Which can then be turned into chapters. We can make, get high quality prayers, potentially. So we just need more faith. For which we already have an excellent prayer, don't we? The combo pair does faith 1 to 3 and sermon faith plus 100 and up to 150%. The prayer for faith itself does the same thing. So that seems fine. That's fine. That's lovely. 
All right, then let's go dungeon. Dungeon. See if we can explore level two. Maybe we'll harvest some skulls here. What do you want again? Nails and blued. I wonder if the dungeon refills with things. You guys sit together so I can get like the double hit in. I missed. That'll work. That's fine. Loots. Come on, slimes. Group up, my friends. Yes. Yes. Sweet. All right, let's keep going. Did we already go down here? No. Uh, that could have been worse. Oh. Sort of, sort of a ton of energy. Barrels? Broken barrels? <laughs> I guess I can harvest scrap wood and stuff. Oh, neat. And iron? Not bad. Can I harvest this whole writing desk? That would be far too practical. What about these barrels? Okay. Nope, onwards and upwards. So when the first branch we went to, the first time we visited was down there, and we didn't find anything worth worth noting. Oops. Nice. Chop, chop, chop. Like a reflecting pond. Hey, this is a classy establishment. Wow, oh, minus ten for the slimes. That's a lot of damage. It's a bucket. There's the stairs down. <laughs> oh no. I can destroy these stairs too. So I wasn't <laughs> it's a very curious design decision to make the dungeon full of a couple of monsters. I mean we haven't got very far, but also like harvestable destroyed items. There's some extra motivation to go visit it. Like I could use a couple more iron parts or something. So we get this chair. Yeah, look at that. Nice. Okay, we're we'll go ahead and kill this guy, because why not? We'd use the experience. What? A pot? No way. Nito Torpedo. <laughs> okay. I wonder if that bucket of water I could pick up too. That's fun. Can't go back home. We gotta walk. Uh, 
Whoa. Now I'm gonna attack everything and squander all my energy. Pots. Some metal scraps that turns into iron. Free iron. Just had to risk my life to get it. <laughs> Those pots out took minus five hit points. And what about this barrel? Oh, two hits to defeat that barrel. Nice. All right, let's get out of here. Fascinating. So let's see, the Inquisitor would be available on this day, but he is needs a bunch of stuff we don't have. Wine, primarily. And I don't think we have that winemaking tech. Tech. Farming. No. But you know, I was thinking about moths and butterflies, and I bet butterflies are collected in the same way moths are, just during the daytime. That's my theory. So we're gonna see if that's true. Just incidentally, probably at some point. Because so far I don't need any moths. Or butterflies. So, a uh, bunch of wood. Score. I guess we don't need this thing. Take those iron parts. Ashes also go here. Metal things go here. Can we? Here we go. Oh, there's not enough fire power. Oh. There we go. Some iron ingots. And we will toss. Oh, that's right, we use graphite to make steel. And is coal the fuel or is graphite the fuel? Probably coal. Graphite doesn't really make sense as fuel, does it? So perhaps we should go and gather some more of that there. Graphite from the mines, from the quarry. We could abandon a bunch of our tools and really go to town. Craft some paper. Okay. All right, we wanted to study that, but we need more faith. And we need more faith to make the book as well. Okay, and the green jelly we're gonna put in our cooking inventory. Now I'm expecting a corpse to come by, but now that I think about it again, I could have, nope, that's the right place for the jelly. And the ashes go here, and the metal goes here. Okay. Busy, busy. <sighs> yep. Oopsie do. So this body is probably not going to be worth very much at this point. <laughs> but we can still get a skull to decorate that place since we're going to burn this body anyway. Um, skin to make paper, as well as to study. I don't think we've studied skin. And maybe in a million years we can turn flesh into money. Although is that, you know, something we morally are okay with? It's a good question.
We've already exhumed the worst body and we did hit graveyard quality 30. So we're just gonna leave the graveyard for now. We're not gonna invest any extra resources into it until we know what we actually need to do. And it's possible that we will have unlocked better um, better grave decorations and stuff by the time we know what our next goal is. This only requires science, so let's take some paper, generate some science, and then we can study the skin. Nice. 20. What a story. How wacky. So story and skin will go there. And it's moon day. That's the astrologer's day. Okay. We're going to go to the quarry next time. My name has been Flailbot. Thank you for enjoying this episode of Graveyard Keeper with me, and I will see you guys next time.